Hi, welcome to Paleo Greenbird. I'm Greenbird. Today's video is going to be a video on flint amping, and it's going to be talking about uh, bulb of percussion. And that is uh, an effect that happens when anytime you take a flake, but especially when you're spalling. So basically, if you look at this stone right here, you'll see that high spot right there. Let's see if I can get that a little closer. See that right there? It's significantly higher than the rest of the stone. And this, um, you know, sort of a, it's not the best example there. You, you, you'll see this when you start to spall. Oop, there goes my camera. You'll see this when you start to spall and when you start to, you know, take large flakes. And what that is, is that when this was taken, this was probably the platform right here, okay? And when that platform was taken, the force of the billet wants to go down into the stone, and like anything else, like electricity, like water, um, you know, like most things in life, it wants to find its way back to an easy exit. So it sort of swoops back up. So that's that area that takes most of the impact creates that bulb of percussion. So that's really important when you want to talk about like spalling different stones to try and get them into a smooth form. Um, anyway, just thought I'd do a quick little video. It's super windy here today. As you can see, my tripod almost got blown away. Um, so if you have any questions about bulb of percussion, go ahead and post them in the comments. I'll see you in the next video. This is Paleo Greenbird signing out. I hope you're having a fantastic day. See you next time. Bye.